Maybe we'll get something really nice from Sindri for completing this as well. Although I'm pretty happy with what we already got. <laughs> Hard to be mad about it. What speaks to you? That's not the correct well, thing to do. Scrounge around a bit more, and we'll build something then. Nope, I can't talk to him. Can't do it, guys. Okay. So I guess that is the reward. That is the main reward. So here's what happens next, guys. I'm going to fast travel to the Volunteer Mines because I, I, I think that is the Dwarven Mines we were in before, where we fought the dragon. I think. Actually, let me scroll through here. Uh, home, Isle of Death. Yeah, this has to be the place. And I know there was a gate there. I think this is the right one. I want to go back there, and I want to try and find that treasure, and then I want to go to the Thor statue and see if I can find that treasure there, because that's a really good one. So why do they call Odin the Lord of the Hay? That refers to a modest example of Odin's thirst for knowledge. The time he spent nine days a dead man. Hung himself by the neck from Yggdrasil's branches, put his spear through his own side, and bled down into the Well of Destiny. He roamed the realms of the dead and plundered the world tree of its secrets until I think quite rightly it got fed up with him and sent him back to the land of the living. Did I not mention he was barking mad? <laughs> what was Atreus gasping about? The Hanged God. Odin spent nine days dead hanging from Yggdrasil, the world tree for the wisdom of life and death and destiny. He goes really far to get what he wants. <laughs> Why did you gasp, Atreus? You just looking at the door? Alright. Okay. Is this where I think it is? God, I hope so. Where the hell am I, even? This might not have been the right place. Come. That was lore. I have no memory of this place, guys. Ah, crap. I don't think this is it. <laughs> No, this must have been where we did some other quest. Atreus, follow me. Sorry, I got distracted. Yeah, that sucks. Well, I fucked up. Okay. Bear with me here, guys. Actually, you know what? Come to think of it. I don't think I actually got to activate the fast travel spot that was there because I didn't even have access to them back then. And because of that, I don't think Boy. I actually like was able to walk up to it and have it like pop on my map, which means I probably can't go straight there, which sucks. That means I have to go track it down manually and I don't have a freaking clue where it was. Not even the first clue, guys. Let alone any other clues after that. Jesus. What is this? Why was there random silver there? Not sure how I didn't pick that up before. Well... Let's set something else to be active for right now. Dead Freight. Oh, yeah, the next tier armor. Yeah, I should at least start doing that. I'm going to make those active, and we'll just kind of, like, sail around, like, head for the closest one and just kind of see what we find along the way. If I can find my way back to the spot I'm trying to get to, so much the better. Otherwise, we'll just chip away at this. There it was again. It's there and then it's not. What does it mean? 
Oh no, I totally missed it that time, so. This is where the tower to Jotunheim should be. Feels strange somehow. No doubt some arcane magics were involved. I would be not at all surprised to learn you are sensitive to that. Oh, here's an upgrade that I never picked up. Check this out. Here. All right. A little extra strength. A little extra goes a long way. And this would be a place that it appears we have ne uh, never docked at before. Cliffs of the Raven. Really? What raven, I wonder. Okay. Well, I do have the ability to open this. I just got to get a flame thingy. Or a wind thingy, rather. Not... Not flame. Beneath the surface? Why did I just get a trophy called Beneath the Surface? I was a second too late to actually look at it. <laughs> Ugh. Maybe because I picked up that upgrade right there, and like after getting a certain amount of them, you get a trophy for it. That'd be my guess. This place is weird. What the hell's going on here? Oh, we're going to have to daisy chain the wind back, guys. I can see that already. Okay, there's a rune chest. Well, that already made it worth the stop here. Okay, so what kind of rune chest... I don't see anything to interact with, guys. Hmm. Whoa! <laughs> okay. Damn, I knocked him back too far. Oh, saw it coming. Couldn't do anything. These guys are pretty tough. Jesus. Okay, we're gonna do this. Yeah, that rock attack takes so much more... So much more rage than, like, other attacks. I didn't really notice that until recently. Okay. Thanks. Thanks for that. Shit face. Get back here! That didn't work. <laughs> That's the trade off with that attack. It's really, really good when you actually land it. But if you don't, it leaves you very vulnerable. Put that. Oh, wow. He attacked me. Through the runic attack. <laughs> How 
enemies are strong. Yeah, that guy was kind of a dick. <laughs> Not a big fan of everything that went down right there. Dark Elf Lord. It was another Lord, guys. It's so strong and has thick armor, but leaves itself open after certain attacks. Thanks. Okay, right off the bat. Let's see this. It's 35. And we have. I think this is the last one. Might as well, right? Fine. Wait, the last what? What are we talking about here? Parasite. Just called me a parasite. <laughs> Boy, over here. Kaveka. Oh, is this a fight? Shit, I wasn't ready for this. Okay, then. Fucking rock that guy. I'll tell you that much. Feels good when I actually land that, guys. No! Oh, yes, I cut him off! That was awesome! That was awesome. Whew. Okay, that went well. Viking, we should watch out when they power up their weapon with say their magic. They can do a powerful triple slam attack. Unless I cut them off with my powerful triple slam attack, which is actually more than triple. <laughs> I must speak with you. Yeah, yeah, what's up? What's wrong? I came to this lake with a group of tradesmen, seeking refuge from the desolation. But how could we know it was even worse at the Lake of Nine? We cannot undo your mistake, Spirit. I know that. But I fear for my captain and crew. I believe they are still under the water. Will you find them for me? Is there anything you can offer us in return? I... I have little to offer. Oh. Well, I'm not sure... Wait! I died wearing a valuable family heirloom. It's yours, if you promise to find my crew. Deal. Thank you. What if I just took it anyway? <laughs> you are learning. Yeah, he is learning. Why didn't you or mom ever tell me about the desolation? I won't speak for your mother, but it was never my concern. Nor should it be yours. Doesn't it concern us if everything around us is dying? Our only concern is reaching Jotunheim. Really? Then why are we exploring all these islands? The resources we find improve our equipment. If we stray from the path, it is only to prepare ourselves for the journey ahead. I can live with that if it means we keep exploring. And helping others. Yeah, good compromise. <laughs> for sure. Yeah, so this is interesting. I saw this giant dead troll thing hanging out here and I was like... Wait a second, didn't we have that on a treasure map or something? And lo and behold, here it is. Found it. This is an Oblivion Stone. I feel like I needed that for something that I wanted, but now I can't remember what for. What to check? Next time we're at a dwarf. Again with this shit? <laughs> Freeloader. Yeah. I'm seriously starting to believe that he's never going to give me health ever again, guys. <laughs> okay. So what else can we do around here? We just opened that up up there. There's a path leading back down. Okay, let's check this out first. Do something useful up there, boy. Make me proud. Proud Papa Kratos. Yeah, nice work. Go team. Your mother smiles down upon you. Ooh. Which this is a Niflheim rune. I know what these chests look like. Nope, just a symbol of heart. <laughs> okay. I was wrong. Wanna see what we can trade those for? Hey! We found the last abandoned ship, guys! That is badass! 
artifact set is complete. Didn't even give me the option to look at it, but that's not a huge deal. <laughs> Great. So now we can turn that in. And I think we'll finally get confirmation that we can actually, like, we are allowed to keep collecting them. Even though we sell the previous ones, we'll still get credit for the set. I mean, it's, we've pretty much been taking that for granted, but now we'll know for certain. Right. So, okay. Let's take a look right up here. Ah. Okay, so this right here seems to be the ultimate goal because we have wind magic in there. I wonder if I can grab that without having to break this stuff. Nope. Okay, so now the question is, how do I break this? There's nothing in that one, right? Right. I mean, it looks like I have room to squeeze a throw in there, but... Is pretty much an invisible wall blocking me off, so... I don't know, could I hit it from the other side? Or do I need to just stand right here? Does this give me a better angle? Maybe? Doesn't really seem much better. Yeah. Can't blow any of it up. What if I get up real close like this? This is annoying because it looks like it should work. Don't think it's meant to though. Okay. Maybe if we get through here. What the hell? I don't know where these guys came from. That didn't work. That was easy. That was pretty easy, wasn't it? Okay, thank you for that distraction. Now, if I may... Wait a second. Okay, so that's not the spot we were actually supposed to hit them from. Well, that makes a lot of sense. Okay, so this is a shortcut. Now that we're here, we can do something or other. Climb up here. This is the spot I need. I don't know why I didn't do that the first time I was up here. <laughs> I was busy. Ah, shit. Okay. Is that the only one? Well, I think it actually was. Doesn't appear to be coming back. Oh. 
Really? Oh, right. I can throw my axe while I'm holding it. It's been a while since I had to do this. But it's actually quite a simple matter. Except I can't charge my throw. So I wasn't prepared to actually throw it right there. <laughs> but yep, that's how that works. Okay. I'm kind of like working backwards here, guys, but we're going to get this. <laughs> is this my ultimate? This is probably my ultimate destination with the wind. But now that path is open, I've got a convenient shortcut. I still haven't seen any way to interact with that rune chest, though. Definitely got to make sure I do that before I'm done here. I don't know why they're blocking me off right there. I guess to facilitate the puzzle, maybe? Think it'd be too easy if I could run right down that road right there? With the wind power? I guess that makes sense. Okay, let's see. We're gonna pull it out, and we're gonna go straight to that one right there. Still don't really have a feel for the range on all those. <laughs> and then from there... I'm not sure which direction we want to go in. Okay, I ultimately want to get it down there. I had time, I don't think I have time to climb that right there. Well, let's try it once, I guess. Are you fucking kidding me? It brings the gate up. Okay, that means I have to go this way then. to go the long way. Can I hit that from down here? I'm pretty sure that's too high. I have to climb that spot right there. There's also one way at the top there. What the hell? This part is more confusing than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> yeah, I don't think there's any way to get through that gate. Climb, Kratos! Climb faster! He does not climb fast enough for that shit. Hmm. Been up here yet? Oh, there's one right there. Okay. I don't think I've actually climbed up to this spot right up here. No, I haven't. Okay, now at this point, I think we've cleared out most of the chests. It's just going to be a matter of figuring out how we need to daisy chain this thing and where we need to actually get it in the end. I think the only spot that matters is the spot way at the bottom there. 
But until then, we have to sort of reverse engineer this, I think. Okay, I can stand right here and grab it, I think. And then I can bring it over here. Oh. Oh, these things are connected to the rune chest. Oh, I get it now. This is a pain in the ass, though. Oh, come on. Let me just see the runes from here. I, did, I should have made a note of what they were. It just cycles through them. I just wish I could see them. Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> okay. It won't let me jump back there. Oh, there it is. You don't actually get the prop for it. Okay, so it's like a weird Z, a flag flying to the right, and an R. This one's going to be the flag. Will you just let me hit it from here? Of course not. Okay, so I'm going to take it out. Where do I want to stick it when I'm done here? That's a weird sentence. Um, you know what? I just want to go back to that one right there. Okay. Long flag. Okay. It's all starting to come together, guys. From here. Oh. Camera's fighting me. Camera's fighting me big time, guys. Ooh, okay. We need the Z and the R. Z! Yeah! Got it. Let's put you right back up there. Okay, and the last one should be up there. So, um, this is doable. This is doable. Also, guys, I think my friends are out in the living room being very noisy playing something right now. Hoping that's not bleeding over into my voice recording, but it may. I feel like I have to give like a noise disclaimer on every single freaking video I make lately. <laughs> There's just always something going on. But yeah, if you hear people like, sh you know, shouting and screaming in the background, it's just my buddies being extremely noisy. Anyways, okay. Rune chess is ours now. Give it. Give it to me. Three out of three horns. Quick tempered, guys. I think that means that our rage is now maxed out, too. <sighs> I gotta confess myself disappointed. I was hoping those bars would end up being a lot longer than they are. But also, how could they be maxed out already? Because we still haven't been, like, nearly everywhere in this game. How could I have found all of these? Maybe they're trophies just for getting, like, half of them? Or some other weird number of them? I really can't say. You're not going to let me do that from here, are you? It's a little too far. I might be able to just run that, though. Wait, where am I going? From here, I can drop down right there. I just keep dropping down. Okay. Yeah, this is easy. 
Okay, give me something good. This one was kind of a pain in the ass. <laughs> I got a legendary Blades Pommel, low perk chance to plant a three second delayed firebomb on enemies on any successful blade hit. Wow. Wow, that, that gives us some good runic and strength. We lose vitality and luck. But it's level six, and we can upgrade it twice. This one has Moderate chance to grant aura of fire, increasing strength, and restoring a small amount of health. I do like that perk. And this one's only low chance. This one's moderate, but it's way better stats, and we can upgrade the hell out of it. Also, that ability just sounds really neat. <laughs> I don't know how it would work in, in practice, but uh, uh, yeah, let's give it a shot. Let's give it the old try. All right, I think I'm done on this island. Oh, there's a there's a busket. One last single solitary busket to pick up. And then I think we're probably done. <laughs> Excellent. Let's get out of here. Still haven't found a heavy runic attack for the blades, guys. It's bringing me down a little bit. <laughs>